Alyssa and welcome back to the Remember Project week number two. And this week we are talking about how you are not your failures. I understand that failing is a horrible feeling, especially when you fail something at school if you're a student. Say you get a D or an F on a test and you think it's the end of the world. Failing is a very unpleasant experience and unfortunately as human beings we are going to experience failure throughout the entirety of our lives. But failure is not an inherently bad thing. When you fail to do something the first time, we're learning from something. Failure is a necessary step in learning sometimes. You have to fail, you have to get back up, you have to try again. And you might fail a second time, or a third time, or a fourth time. You might fail so many times that you just don't get the point of what you're doing anymore. But failure is necessary. It's hard, but it's necessary. And in the end, you will grow from your failures. Learn from the mistakes you have made. Learn from the mistakes other people have made. And don't forget the lessons that you've learned from your failures. But even when you do fail, that does not define who you are as a person. No matter how many times you fail, no matter in how many ways, that does not define you. Failing is a part of learning. And that is why life is full of failure. And that isn't always a bad thing. So remember that your failures do not define who you are. 